Jesus Christ! Oh, this is why you brought me out here? You smell a bunch of goddamn freaks? Yeah. Okay, okay. Come on, follow him. Wait, wait, wait. Follow him? Where the hell are we going? You'll see. Come on. Don't get too close. Stay down. Just what the hell are we doing, Zeke? This doesn't seem all that smart, even for a goddamn drifter. Hold up, hold up. You remember telling me about how the tourists used to flood up from California in the summer, choke off Highway 97 and the I-5 freeway? Yeah. In July, folks smelled almost as bad as these here freaks. Well, you weren't wrong about one thing. These freaks, the big groups, the ones that some call hordes, I think they're the reason we can't get their numbers down. What do you mean? Think about it, man. I've been out here in the shit collecting bounties for more than a year. Boozer, too. Ricky, Schizo, a few others. How many freaks you think I killed? A few. A few. Yeah, but their numbers never go down. <laughs> Stay down. doesn't seem all that smart, even for a goddamn drifter. Hold up, hold up. You remember telling me about how the tourists used to flood up from California in the summer, choke off Highway 97 and the I-5 freeway? Yeah. In July, folks smelled almost as bad as these here freaks. But you weren't wrong about one thing. These freaks, the big groups, the ones that some call hordes, I think they're the reason we can't get their numbers down. What do you mean? Think about it, man. I've been out here in the shit collecting bounties for more than a year. Boozer, too. Ricky, Schizo, a few others. How many freaks you think I killed? A few. A few. Yeah, but their numbers never go down. You got a point? Stay down. What the hell are we doing, Deke? This doesn't seem all that smart, even for a goddamn drifter. Hold up, hold up. You remember telling me about how the tourists used to flood up from California in the summer, choke off Highway 97 and the I-5 freeway? Yeah. In July, folks smelled almost as bad as these here freaks. But you weren't wrong about one thing. These freaks, the big groups, the ones that some call hordes, I think they're the reason we can't get their numbers down. What do you mean? Think about it, man. I've been out here in the shit collecting bounties for more than a year. Boozer, too. Ricky, Schizo, a few others. How many freaks you think I killed? A few. A few. Yeah, but their numbers never go down. You got a point? It's these whores. Every night, there's a steady stream of them <laughs> up and down the sand. Thousands of... Stay down. Just what the hell are we doing, Deke? This doesn't seem all that smart, even for a goddamn drifter. Hold up, hold up. You remember telling me about how the tourists used to flood up from California in the summer, choke off Highway 97 and the I-5 freeway? Yeah. In July, folks smelled almost as bad as these here freaks. Well, you weren't wrong about one thing. These freaks, the big groups, the ones that some call hordes, I think they're the reason we can't get their numbers down. What do you mean? Think about it, man. I've been out here in the shit collecting bounties for more than a year. Boozer, too. Ricky, Schizo, a few others. How many freaks you think I killed? A few. A few. Yeah, but their numbers never go down. You got a point? It's these hordes. Every night, there's a steady stream of them up and down the Sandy Empire. Thousands of times, pouring... Stay down. Just what the hell are we doing, Deke? This doesn't seem all that smart, even for a goddamn drifter. Hold up, hold up. You remember telling me about how the tourists used to flood up from California in the summer, choke off Highway 97 and the I-5 freeway? Yeah. In July, folks smelled almost as bad as these here freaks. 
But you weren't wrong about one thing. These freaks, the big groups, the ones that some call hordes, I think they're the reason we can't get their numbers down. What do you mean? Think about it, man. I've been out here in the shit collecting bounties for more than a year. Boozer 2, Ricky, Schizo, a few others. How many freaks you think I killed? A few. A few. Yeah, but their numbers never go down. You got a point? It's these whores. Every night, there's a steady stream of them up and down the sandy and highway. Thousands of freaks pouring into the Lost Lake Valley, north of the Cascades. And you think they're coming up from California? I was closed off. No one's been south of the Santium Pass in years. It's not closed off to the hordes. Freaks are the reason it's closed off. Anyway, the point I'm trying to make is that the hordes come in every night. Not a goddamn thing we can do to stop them. that much right. Lost more than a few men trying to back in the day. Yeah, I know. I was there. And every horde that comes through leaves a few stragglers or gets busted up and scatters and, and just like that, freaks everywhere as far as the eye can see. to see them to know that they're around. We figure out a way to stop the hordes coming through. Maybe we can make some headway, reduce their numbers. Make it safer. Free up more farmland, irrigation. Yeah. Okay, so how do we do that? You know goddamn well you can't take on a, a, a whatever you call it, a, a horde? This is how. How be God. Damn. Yeah. They stand there all day, hibernating or whatever the hell freaks do. So what are you thinking that we... Yep. We blow it the hell up. Stick it down to my there, there, and there. We bring down a mountain of rock. We seal this shit up. Yeah, so we trap a few hundred inside. What good is that gonna no, do? No, no, you don't get it. We seal this cave. Maybe they don't got no place to sleep. Or maybe this trail of piss and shit dries out, goes stale, and others stop coming. Yeah. All right. All right. You got my attention. Okay. Come on. Let's head back. All right. My knees are warmed up a bit. Let's see if you can keep up. Yeah, okay. Tell me, when does being out in the shit make you an expert on freaks? You spend your spare time just following them around, seeing what makes them tick? Not exactly. And how do you know about all this? About what a horde's gonna do, where they sleep? A few days ago, I was riding north of Belknap Crater when a chopper flew by. A chopper? What the hell? Just listen to me. It was a black chopper. One of those Nero choppers that used to fly all over the goddamn place when the shit was going down. And you saw one, still flying. I followed him. I stole one of their radios. I've been trying to track him down, see if they have a base around here. Supplies. Shit, I mean, see if the feds are still alive, you know what I'm saying? They're out here doing field work of some kind, on the freaks. They're studying them. 
They got resources to do that while we're out here starving, fighting to stay alive. I followed them up to the grotto caves. You know the ones? Yeah. They had motion sensors set up, measuring how many freaks used the cave during the day, and, uh, Mike, it was thousands. That right. They said freaks all up and down the Cascade Range, south of Crater Lake and north up to Smith Rock, all used these lava tube caves to hibernate. So, we blew up those caves. Maybe we have a few less to deal with. Hey, this idea of yours, it's got some merit, but a job like that, it's gonna take a fair amount of TNT. He said you wanted help making Lost Lake safer. This is how we do it. <sighs> All right. All right, look, there's some things I gotta do, okay? But you meet me at the bridge in a couple of minutes. I know where we can find some. St. John, you were supposed to be up at the farm an hour ago. My guy said he's got a shovel waiting for you. Yeah, Schizo, about that, I'm busy. See, Iron Mike and I, we're just heading out on a run. You and Iron Mike, you'll get your ass up that way today. Or you and your gimp boyfriend are gonna find yourselves out in the shit. You hear me? Without a goddamn battle! Yeah, yeah, I'll get right on that. St. John out. I wonder about the freaker sometimes, you know? Ready? Where are we headed? This time you're gonna have to trust me. Okay, where are we going? You know what they use to mine all around these parts? Yeah, uh, mercury or something. That's right, cinnabar. The extracted mercury from cinnabar. Folks back east think it was gold mines out here and silver. Not so. Back in the early 1900s, Cinnabar was worth more than gold. To operate the mine, you need TNT for expansion, blowing out new tunnels, clearing cave-ins, that sort of shit. And to own TNT, you had to register with the county, keep copies of the keys to all your lockboxes with the commissioner. Wait, the county courthouse? Where the hell is that? Thought you knew. It's in the old federal building. The old federal building? The one in Sherman's camp? Jesus, Mike. What the hell? You told me... You, you told me that you were never setting foot in that place again. Did I? I don't recall. You were drunk right after Joe was killed. Did I tell you why? No. Here! Turn right, here! This is it. Mike. The place is gonna be crawling. I don't, I don't think this is a good idea. Uh, weather holds will be safe enough. All right. That there? It's the old federal building. That's where we're headed. Let's not go looking for trouble. Stay out of the buildings. Come on. We gotta head over this way. Where are we headed? Just follow me. Key will be on the commissioner. And and you know where he is? <laughs> where his body is? Yeah, I think I do. You heard what happened here. Yeah, everybody got wiped out, man, woman, and child. Only a few got out, and and uh, you you were one of them, right? Only two got out. Me and no. <laughs> but it wasn't the freaks that took us out. What do you mean? Here.
Size called a truce. A meeting. Right here. Oh, we knew what was coming. We knew what was coming and we were prepared. Fight didn't last long, but, but it was bad. They had ammunition left after all, and well, they... Oh, hell, you can see what they did. Like I said, two people walked out of this town after all was said and done. And some days... the hell one of them wasn't me. Commissioner's over there in the bean counter suit. Go get the key so we can get the hell out of here. You didn't give a damn about sealing the caves. You brought me here because... Because you, you brought me here because you wanted me to see this. Not true. All right, you got the key. We're going to go get the maps to those mines, just like I said, and we're going to get more than enough TNT to seal every cave in the valley. Bullshit. You are right about one thing. I'm not sorry you've seen it. Not following you, Mike. I am talking about the war that's coming. With the... Rippers. The one that Schizo <laughs> saw. How you cares how many die <laughs> on either <laughs> side? Never mind. Come on, let's get this door open. Here's the door. Place is locked up tight. Come on, gotta find a way upstairs. Smells like something died in here. Okay. All right, this is it. Now we got maps to every mine in the county showing where they stored their dynamite. Okay, come on. You hear that? Yeah. Were well, you expecting anyone? Nope. Do you have my back here? Hey, I don't like starting trouble, but I'll finish it if I have to. Stay behind me. Hey, I could take care of myself. I'm not saying you can't, but remember the last time that we were out in the shit. Yeah, like I said, I'm staying behind you. What the hell? Something feels wrong. He's hiding somewhere. Yeah, that's all of them. Let's go. Right behind you.
this. Jesus, what a mess! You know why no one goes into Sherman's camp. Eddie finds out you're out here risking your ass like this, she's gonna be pissed. Now, how would she find out about something like that? Not from me. the rippers why you wanted me to see that shit no deke i always saw a bit of myself in you back in the day how's that you don't give a shit oh you care about your friend don't want to see him die but me any other goddamn person on the planet i don't think so terry will just get you killed yeah that's right thing is not terry will get you killed just as easy Good folks of Sherman Camp did will stop caring about anyone but themselves and their own. Easy to kill a man when he's just some piece of meat standing between you and what you need. Schizo wants to kill Rippers because he don't think they're human anymore. They don't count. He's standing in the way of what he wants. Well, I don't buy into that shit. I won't have it. You know, Schizo, he, uh, he wonders why I'm a pacifist. That's, you know, that's what he likes to call me. He, uh, he thinks I'm gonna get everybody killed. Well, are you, Mike? Are you gonna get everyone killed? Freaks aren't gonna be around forever. Now, when they're gone, we're gonna need some folks around here to help pick up the pieces. Hey, look, hey, hey. I don't like Carlos and his rippers any more than I like Tucker or, or Copeland and his, his, his goddamn truthers. All right, but here, look. Here's the thing, Deke. I'm not going out of my way to kill any of them. I've had my share of killing. Even if Carlos comes for you, My truce will hold. You can bet on that. Now, yeah, for once, I agree with Schizo. The Rippers, they ain't human. Not anymore.
Where the hell's my ratchet wrench? Never find anything. Looking to buy, Hope. Wow. She's looking for some stuff. Check back later, I guess. See you around. Hey, man. Uh, bringing in some bounties? Oh, okay. Hold on. That's all I got today. Hey, Blair. I got all kinds of stuff. Good one. Um, okay. Uh, good choice. Yep, that's nice. Now that's an upgrade. Yep. See you around. Hey, man. Check on him. <laughs> Hope he's awake. Yeah, Mike, this is Deke. Butcher brought in Shane Riley, but when I went to the shack to question him, he wasn't there. Uh, yeah, uh, about that, Mike. I tried to bring him in. I really did, but he, uh, well, he put up a hell of a fight. So he didn't leave me much choice, Mike. He did. Remember what I said about how we do things around here. Yeah, yeah, Mike, I remember. Lost Lake out. <laughs> DQ 
think you gotta hurry. Ricky with... O'Brien, oh, I'm at one of your beacons. The one outside of Rogue Camp. Drifter, uh, uh, St. John. I mean, uh, copy that. Why am I here? I show, uh, Hilo incoming to that location now. Be ready. O'Brien out. Uh, psh. That's why I'm here. St. John, they should have arrived at your location. Do you see them? Yeah, yeah, kind of hard to miss. What do you need me to do? Get close to the researcher. Remember, you have to stay in their proximity or I can't intercept their data. I need okay, the area yeah, secured now. All right, spread out. This time, I need you to plant all those trackers on their helo. Their chopper. Let me know when it's clear. I know what a helo is, O'Brien. And you better have something for me. I got someone I trust working on it. We'll know soon enough. O okay. We're ready to upload the data as soon as you're close. O'Brien out. <laughs> O'Brien, O'Brien, are you there? Done. I can't talk right now. I'll be on this I'll channel later. This. Out. It should work. O'Brien, oh god damn it. I'm getting tired of being your errand boy, O'Brien. Oh. 
Deke, you gotta hurry. Ricky, what's going on? That guy we've been looking for, Eric Lynch, who, who murdered Camel and Reed at the farm. The Lynch man. Son of a bitch. You know where he is? Yes, uh, yeah. He's on the north shore at the old boat launch. Skizzle wanted to go after him, but Iron Mike said to get you. I'll get to Deacon, can you stop by? Oh, let me guess. You got a job for me. Yeah, okay. St. John out. Hello. Hey, Blair. How's life? Uh, good choice. Uh, yep. See you around. Uh, hold on. I'll get the door. Making my day a lot more complicated. Okay, fine. I'll chase him down. Deacon out. <laughs> Still got. Oh shit! There he is. Edmonds, man, come on! No, you're not gonna get away. You're not keeping me alive! Did you hear me say, John?
How's it going, Lynch man? What, is the camp not feeding you well enough? Fuck you! Thought you'd just kill a couple guys right off with our shit? Don't matter if a bunch of folks here die of starvation because you got what you need, right? <laughs> Get off of me, you son of a bitch! Hey, 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 listen to me. Rick is gonna send some men for you. You tell them where you stash the seeds, and maybe they'll just shoot you, you know, instead of hanging you slow. What do you think about that? I don't know what the hell you're talking about! Okay, man, suit yourself. Hey, Ricky, I got him, and I'll uh, send you his position. Send someone out here to pick him up. Does he have the seeds on his bike? Please! Don't leave me here! No, no, I didn't see him. Freaks will get me! Please! All right, we'll bring him in. Lost Lake out. See you, Lynch man. I can fix this. That'll hold. the gate. It's that drifter. Yeah, I know him. How's it going, brother? No, Deke. I don't know about you, but, uh, I could use a hand. Uh, <laughs> you lay down. <laughs> Yes, ma'am. <laughs> he can't have visitors uh, just yet, but uh, I could really use a hand. Yeah, I'll see you later. I'll be here. Hey, Doc, Doc, seriously, though. Um, will I be able to play piano after all this is over? Very funny, William. Lay down. <laughs> okay. I could play chopsticks. No, seriously, I could. I'd be like... <laughs> As you can see, he's going to be just fine. His fever's completely gone. Good, that's good. All right, well, I gotta go take care Deacon, of some shit. like I said before, William really does owe you his life. Boozer doesn't owe me shit. I owe him. Hey, I saved two more. Eddie and Mia would have died without those antibiotics. I just thought you should know. Seems like he's uh, getting better. Uh, hello. Hey, Blair. How's life? Um, okay. Uh, you would come back soon, huh? How's it going? Just looking for some stuff. Man, your bike's looking good now. Mike's looking pretty busted.
Okay. Later. Hey, I got a job for you. You got a job for me? Yeah. There's a bunch of dead freaks. The rest of the footbridge stuck in the muck. I need someone to pull them out and take them to the burn pile. Got it? Marsh duty. Yeah. Get someone else. I'm busy. Hey, I'm getting you to do it. I don't know what Mike told you on your little field trip, but we got work to do. Here. Hey, 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 hey. Schizo. He can't come with you. He's coming with me. Last I checked, I wasn't talking to you. Well, I checked in with Mike. I gotta go into the shit, and he's coming with me. All right? Like I said, I'm busy. And when you get back, you come find me. You coming? Where? Doesn't matter. Seriously, where are we headed? North. Ricky, I don't have time for your crap any more than schizos. Come on, I'll show you. Mike told me what you did. I didn't do anything. About how if we seal the caves here, we can stop the hordes? Never said it would stop them. Maybe slow them down. <laughs> Look, are you going somewhere with this? Yeah. I just thought that maybe you decided to stay. I mean, not just because of Boozer, but because you wanted to help. Is that what you thought? Hey, back in the day, I did my share of runs. You did, but never anything more than that, and you know it. So now you're helping Iron Mike seal the caves? What did you want me to think? See, a few weeks back, we lost a man when this went down. Shutting down the infirmary's respirator. Respirator? Oh, God, Ricky, look around. If you're on a respirator out here, you're already dead. What if it had been Boozer? Yeah, that's what I thought. See, we haven't had power for almost two years, but the transformers and the lines, they all check out. Well, at least they do here. I want to ride up north. Check out the hydro dam just to see why it shut down. Oh, no. Riding escort, that's Schizo's job. I don't need an escort. You lived up there. You know the area better than anyone. Deacon, you asked for my help, right? Now I'm asking for yours. Shh. Okay, good. I'm gonna go grab some of the guys nope. that can run. Nope. No, you're not. Now we're going in quiet. We're running to Copeland's men. I can handle them, but that wilderness up there is crawling with rippers and scumbags and God knows what else. More men, you know what that means? That means more attention. No, uh-uh, no, we're doing this my way. Shit. Fine, okay, let's go. Look, Ricky, uh, I gotta ask you. The other night, uh, I hit me in the infirmary. Would I have shot you in the face? No. Really? Oh. Look in your face, you... I would have taken you outside first and then shot you in the face. <laughs> okay, so you wouldn't, you know, want to get blood all over the infirmary. Uh-huh, exactly. If we get an early start, we can get back before dark. As long as nothing goes wrong. <laughs> well, what can go wrong? Following you. Just follow the route that I marked on your map. There's some marauder camps up there we want to stay away from. Yeah, got it. So how did you end up out here? I never asked you. Same as everyone, I guess. When shit went down, I was a hundred miles from home.